Hi, this is Mike Schmitz, and welcome to another edition of Screencasts Online. This week, we'll be taking a look at IA Writer, an iOS and Mac based text editor. Ulysses has gotten most of the attention lately, and rightfully so, it's a great application, but it's also subscription based. So if you're looking for a powerful plain text writing app that is also a one-time purchase, IA Writer is a great option. It's a very solid alternative that has a lot of the same bells and whistles that you'll find in other text editors, like phenomenal markdown support, a great looking dark mode, focus mode, and the ability to publish directly to the web, but it also has a few tricks of its own, like the keyboard bar, which allows you to insert elements into your document and syntax highlighting, which can actually make you a better writer. In this episode, we're going to look at IA Writer primarily on the iPad, but we'll also look at the Mac interface. We'll cover all the editing and organizational features of IA Writer and dive into the settings to uncover some of the more powerful features of the app. Let's get started. All right, let's begin by opening the IA Writer application by tapping on the icon on our iPad home screen. And as the application opens, we can see two major areas in the IA Writer interface. On the left is the library, which is showing four folders in our iCloud folder for IA Writer. And on the right side of the screen, taking up most of the iPad screen that's showing at the moment, is the editor. Right now, the title at the top says untitled, but we haven't created anything in the editor yet. We can change that simply by tapping in the editor. The text cursor appears and the iPad keyboard slides up from the bottom. Now we can start entering our text. Now, IA Writer is a plain text writing app designed to give you a clean, simple, distraction free writing environment so you can focus on the words that you're writing. And if you're coming from a word processor like Microsoft Word or Apple's Pages, you might be wondering how you mark up text because you don't see all of the options in the toolbars that you would see in one of those standard word processors. That doesn't mean you can't mark up your text though because IA Writer is built on the markdown formatting language that is popular in a lot of different writing apps like Ulysses, Bear, and Byword, just to name a few. If you're unfamiliar with Markdown, it's a markup language developed by John Gruber of Daring Fireball in an effort to make something human readable that translates easily into HTML for publishing on the web. And we're not going to go into all of the specifics with Markdown, but I will walk through a couple of things that you can do using Markdown in IA Writer. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone, and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a Screencasts Online member. <laughs> 